Good morning, teacher. How are you? Fine. Good. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Yeah, how was your weekend? It was wonderful. <laughs> yes, what did you do? Uh, on Friday, I was cleaning my house. And Saturday, I was cooking for three or four hours. Three or four hours? Yes. What did because you do? I, I cook only once a week. Ah, okay. So you did the cooking for the whole week. And, and we, we are, uh, we are a special train in in swimming. Yes. Because next Sunday um, we will have yes. a, a race, no competition, only race. Yes. Uh, from. Caletilla to uh, Roqueta. Yes. And to Roqueta from Caletilla. Okay. A race. A race. Swimming. Swimming. Wow. <laughs> now that is amazing. Oh, yes. I, I hope will be no will do it yes i yes. wish you good luck thank you and have fun yes and good morning fabulous hi good morning good morning how are you very good very good very good very very good Okay, what did you do all weekend? You had four days weekend. Yes, yeah. yeah, Fabi, <laughs> we need you. Uh, um, I didn't do anything. Only I went to uh, sister house uh, yesterday. Well, that's nice. Did you cook a special meal? Uh, no. <laughs> no? No. What's your special meal? Some meal? No. Nothing. No? <laughs> Chilaquiles, enchiladas, tostadas. No, uh, we ate uh, carne enchilada. How, how do you say carne enchilada? Okay. Uh, seasoned, seasoned meat. Yes, is Mexican style, I suppose. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ladies. Uh, Miguel's not here. Karen, have you heard about Karen? No. She okay. she is busy in the morning with her mother. Ah, okay. Every day. Every day. Yeah, that's too bad. Yes. Is she is she watching the uh, videos? Hmm. Yeah. I get huh? a little. You are a little? That's good, Fabi. That's good. Okay. Did you ladies do your homework? No. <laughs> lesson A. Yeah, lesson A. <laughs> yes. You did do your homework? Yes. I All did. Right. Let's take a look at it. And right there. What do you have, uh, Laura? You oh. can ask Fabi to help you. Wait a minute. I, I lost it. I'm ready. 
ready? Go ahead. Ah. Bobby. I... Bobby, can you write? This. It's very difficult for me. But I try. Yeah, okay. yeah. Very, very good. Thank you. And what happened with Miguel? I don't know. The first is there is Miguel right there. There is no electricity here in my house. Well, in the old Peloso. Oh. So I had to uh, get a Telcel internet. Oh my God. <laughs> so maybe you guys were trying to log in earlier and couldn't log in. Good morning, Miguel. Good morning. How are you, Miguel? So now let's get ready to rumble. Miguel, can you help uh, Fabi and Lauren fill up the, the homework, please? All right. Go ahead. Go. Uh, um, Lauren, the field is running too. I I have telepathy. Ah, it's okay. Um, maybe. I don't know. I what? have a problem with the audio. Miguel, the and your microphone. You you have a promise for us. Ah yes. Today, he will have a new microphone. Let's take a look at me. So, let me see how can I help you. I have a problem with the internet. But yes, it happens. All right, so let's continue. So you were saying, Lauren, what do you have for number one? I have telepathy. Miguel, can you write telepathy? Good. Telepathy, the H is in the uh, with the T. Only one A O oh, is in. <laughs> After T. Perfect. Next. Next, I have the Jabu. Okay, next. Sticks in my mind. Next, confidences. Out of the blue. Oh. 
run into. By accident, the last one. Perfect. Good job. Thanks. All of this is correct. Okay. Oh my God. There you go. Next. Thank you, Miguel. And the next one will be. Oh my gosh, what did I do? There. Complete the story, use a simple past or the past perfect. Sometimes more than one answer is possible. Continue guys. Fabi, can you write this one? Right, and now it's very difficult. I know, but Lauren can help you. Lauren, Fabi, Megan, can you work as a team and complete this? With Tari. The story. We had a great time and then all night. So we decided to meet the next day. What? We um, had dated Dated, that is, dated. <laughs> Miguel, no te rías. Don't laugh. We have dated. For about four months, when she invited me to a party at her apartment, I was looking at the pictures of her college friends around her apartment, and I noticed. that my cousin Tiara from Chicago was in one of her photos. It turns out that my girlfriend and my cousin have been roommates, have been roommates for over three years in college, but they hadn't seen each other for about a year. Haven't seen each other for about a year. What a coincidence. Yes, over here is Hard Rock, uh, we started, yes, we decided, yes, and then the next one is we had dated, 
when she invited me, okay? And I noticed, yes, my cousin had been, yes, but they hadn't seen. This over here, it's also okay to say where. Because it's the person of B. So it's okay to say had been or where. Okay, guys? Only, only where, teacher? No. It's where? okay to say had been or where. In this one right here, it's okay to say where or had been. Either or, it's okay. Okay. Remember to read the instructions. It says sometimes more than one answer is possible. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah. So this one is right here. Also, well, it's okay. Next. Next one. Read the story, then answer the questions about below using the past perfect. Here we have the story. We have the questions. Why was Peter feeling confident? He had written a good cover letter and zoom. Perfect. Well, that's the example, right? Yes. Uh, number two, why was his resume very strong? He had paid a professional to help him. Very good. Fabi, number three. Why did she sleep late on Wednesday morning? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Miguel? Me either, Miguel. No? You don't know, guys? I know. I, I didn't do homework. Uh, yeah, you need to read. So, why did he sleep later on Monday? On Wednesday, Lauren? His alarm clock stopped. Yes. His alarm clock stopped in the middle of the night. In the middle of the night. And didn't go off. Okay. Number four. Why was he able to leave home so quickly? He had gotten his things ready. ready. Yes, perfect. He had done his, his clothes, his shoes, his suit ready the night before. Good job. Number five. Uh, five. Why didn't he have enough gas to drive to the interview? I, I have, he had it, had time to get gas. That's right, he hadn't had time. Yes, Lauren, that's good. Number six. 
Why did he have enough money for a taxi? He had gone to an ATM to yes. get cash. Yes, that's good. Next, seven. Had Peter met the woman before? No, he hadn't known her. He hadn't met her. Met her, okay. Maybe not met her. Had Peter met the woman before? Peter didn't know her, didn't but her. she obviously. Probably yes, right? How do you think the woman recognized Peter? Maybe she was his neighbor? No? no? I don't know. The same as in Spanish, Miguel. Obviously. 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 <laughs> was the woman? Maybe or no? Yes. Maybe. Yes, maybe. <laughs> okay, next. About you. Write about a strange experience or coincidence. You need to write this, guys. Write this and post it on the WhatsApp group, okay, please? Okay. Yes, Lauren? Yes. Perfect. Now let's continue. Now we're going to get out of here and we're going to go to lesson B. We're going to continue with lesson B. And here it is. Lauren? Yes? Miguel, can you share with, with Fabi what is good luck? to find a lifty floating uh, in the cup of tea. Yes, good job. Yes, sir. It's good luck to it's good luck to Yes. <laughs> 
<laughs> Sir, it's a good opinion, but it's not take. Then you mean drink. It's good to drink tea every morning. Is that what you're trying to say? Okay, not take, drink. Okay, so good opinion, sir. What else is a good, uh, what, what is, is good luck, uh, Lauren? Um, it's good luck to pick up a coin. Okay, continue. Uh, to stand between uh, two person of the same name. Yes. Are you reading the book? No. You're remembering. Yes. <laughs> Very good. But okay. I, I, I forget. Ropa al revés. Miguel. 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 Into out. Yeah, something like that. Yes, you do, you do Miguel. You asked me about it and I answered you. <laughs> you don't remember. I don't remember. <laughs> Inside out. I don't remember. Miguel, do you remember? Miguel, me, oh, oh, oh Miguel. <laughs> it is about a, a dream. Yes, it's good luck to dream about a snake holding you tightly. What about this one? Bad luck to to see a crowd in the morning. Yeah. There you go, Miguel. <laughs> Good job. Next, continue. It's bad luck to to leave the purse on the floor. Yes. It's bad luck to wear fear in a wedding. Yes. Lost your purse? Yes, of course. You lose your purse. But you leave it on the floor. Come on. <laughs> no, you lose the money. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. 
if you get a boyfriend or girlfriend, a pair of shoes, he or she will leave you. Good. So, can you complete the sentence? Uh, it's bad luck to... It's bad luck to if you give a if boyfriend. To if you give, no. It's uh, bad luck to... What's next, honey? What's up to two? You two? What? Even? To uh, give. I, after two, you have a verb. Give. Yes, continue. It's bad not to get a boyfriend, a girlfriend, a pair of two. And that's it. Uh, 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 uh. And that's it. That's the action. That's the activity. Ah, okay. Yeah. So it's bad luck to give, give a boyfriend, a girlfriend, a pair of Like that, okay. And the last one, what about this one? Do you remember, Lauren? It's bad luck to, to sweep your feet. Your feet, no. No, to... Uh, yeah, to sweep. To broom. No. <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> to sweep over. Sweep over an unmarried woman. Yeah. Yes. All right. All right. Now let's continue with the next one. Here. Um, can you complete this, please? In one minute. Two minutes. Yes. Impossible. Shade only you twin. What? A snake. Uh -huh. Dream of no dream of a snake. snake. Hold oh. you tightly. Make it right. Pick up coins you find. Put cloth on inside out. Put cloth on inside out. Ay, no me sale. Yes, put 
cloth. Clouds. Cloth. Sigue. C L O T H E S. Yes. On um, side out. On inside. <laughs> <laughs> On inside out. Mm, let's see. Dream of Shaky. Again, it. Stand between two people with the same name, no? Yes. The last one is stand between two people with the same name. Between. W E between <laughs> two one two E two people second E second E first E one Andale, excellent. Yes. Two, one, two. Number. Number. Two people, me, two, one, two. P, W, O. <laughs> It's okay. Another side. One second. One two. Only for me. A. <laughs> okay. Yeah, the next. Other, the other side. The other side. See a crowd in the morning. See a crowd in the morning. Hey. Right. See, see what? I see a crowd in the morning. See a crowd in the morning, Nige. Um, 
leave your porch on the floor. Give a boyfriend a pair of shoes. Give, ah, yes. Give. Give a boyfriend a pair of shoes. It's very difficult. Ay. Leave. Your porch on the floor. The first one is leave your porch on the floor. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> ah yes. Wear fears if you are a bride. Wear ears in the wedding. Spears. P E A R L S. Spears. It is pearls, Lori. Pearls. Yes, pearls. A R L S. Pearls. Pearls. Yeah, that's all. Hi there. Sweet. Over. Oh. Yeah, All right, guys, are you finished? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. What? What? Which was the one that's missing? Sweep over Sweet. Um, an unmarried woman. woman's feet. Yes, there you go. Now, can you read, Fabi, please? Um, speaking and listening. Mm -hmm. Look or not? Looking. Lucky. Or lucky. Lucky. Lucky or not? Lucky or not? Um, do you know any superstition about the things below? Tell the class. Guys, do you know any superstitions about? Yes. The cat. Yes. A cat. To Black see a cat. cat is bad luck. Yes. Why? I don't know. What happens? The is the hell. No, evil. Evil. <laughs> what about this? What is? I don't recognize. Is a mirror? Yes, it's a mirror. Uh, Braid uh, seven years. Bad luck. Seven years. Yes, if you break it, wow. Yes. What about this? Uh, if you find a good lot forever. Really? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what about this? Uh, I don't I know. know. You don't know? No. Okay, then let's continue. Can you read Lauren, please? 
Listen to four people talk about superstitions. Do they think the things above are lucky? L. And or unlucky, you write L or U in the boxes. Okay. Hello, guys. Hi. Hello. Sorry. One more time, please. Okay. Wow. Listen and write. L for lucky and write U for unlucky. Yeah. What is lucky? Um, good luck. Yes, good luck. Oh my gosh. And what is unlucky? Bad, bad luck. Yes, bad luck. Perfect. Listen and check. Page 56. Lesson B, superstitions. Two, speaking and listening. Lucky or not? B, listen to four people talk about superstitions. Do they think the things above are lucky or unlucky? Write L or U in the boxes. One. Oh, a black cat. Well, there are many different ideas about black cats in different countries. I guess what most people believe is that if a black cat walks toward you or crosses your path, you know, walks across in front of you, then something bad will happen. You'll have some kind of bad luck. So basically, black cats are unlucky, I guess. Two. Superstitions about mirrors? The only one I know is if you break a mirror, you'll have seven years of bad luck. These things often come in sevens, so you have to be careful when you're hanging up a mirror or cleaning or holding one, because if you drop it, you'll have bad luck for seven years. You don't want that. Three. A four-leaf clover, yeah. Clover's a kind of plant, like grass, and it usually has three leaves on it. So if you find one with four leaves, it's supposed to be really lucky. I guess this is because they're so rare. You don't find many of them. I've never found one, though I've spent a lot of time looking. So, yeah, it's good luck to find a four-leaf clover. Four. Huh. A yellow butterfly? There are a lot of superstitions about butterflies, both yellow ones and white ones. In some countries, they think if you see a yellow butterfly, then your wish will come true. So, it's lucky. I think all butterflies usually bring good luck. Another one I heard is that if you see a yellow butterfly in the spring, you'll get a lot of new clothes. Now, that would be nice. All right, guys. So, can you please mark the boxes? Yes. There you go. U-U-L-L. Easy. Next, can you please read, Lauren? Where? Listen again? Yes. Can you write down each superstition? Compare with a parent. You can write it in your book. And then we write here on the screen, okay? 
Are you ready, guys? Page 56. 2. Speaking and listening. Lucky or not? C. Listen again. Can you write down each superstition? Compare with a partner. 1. Oh, a black cat. Well, there are many different ideas about black cats in different countries. I guess what most people believe is that if a black cat walks toward you or crosses your path, you know, walks across in front of you, then something bad will happen. You'll have some kind of bad luck. So basically, black cats are unlucky, I guess. 2. Superstitions about mirrors? The only one I know is if you break a mirror, you'll have seven years of bad luck. These things often come in sevens, so you have to be careful when you're hanging up a mirror or cleaning or holding one, because if you drop it, you'll have bad luck for seven years. You don't want that. 3. A four-leaf clover, yeah. Clover's a kind of plant, like grass, and it usually has three leaves on it. So if you find one with four leaves, it's supposed to be really lucky. I guess this is because they're so rare. You don't find many of them. I've never found one, though I've spent a lot of time looking. So, yeah, it's good luck to find a four-leaf clover. 4. Huh. A yellow butterfly? There are a lot of superstitions about butterflies, both yellow ones and white ones. In some countries, they think if you see a yellow butterfly, then your wish will come true. So, it's lucky. I think all butterflies usually bring good luck. Another one I heard is that if you see a yellow butterfly in the spring, you'll get a lot of new clothes. Now, that would be nice. You please write down each superstition. What is this? Mm. It's bad luck to, to walk. To walk? Mm -mm. Or oh. oh, crow? Yes. Crows and black cat. There you go. Yes? What about the next one? Lauren? Mm, it's bad luck to break a mirror. To what? To break. Break. To break. To break a mirror. Good. Next. Bobby, Miguel, Lauren, number three. Good luck. Good luck to find a four leaf clover. Good. And the last one. It's good luck to see. To yellow. Yellow. To what? Yellow. To see a yellow butterfly. There you go. Good job, guys. That was correct. Okay. Next. Now, building language. But before we do that, guys. Are you superstitious? A little. <laughs> yes, a little. Who left? Miguel. What happened to Miguel? Yeah? What superstition do you believe in? Uh, the mirror. 
The mirror, okay. yes. What about you, Lauren? Um, the four leaf clover. Yes. All right. Yeah. And is that it? Or do you have another superstition? Another superstition? I had another. And uh, the leaf, uh, your porch in, in the floor. Uh, yeah, you have that superstition? Yes, I I don't like my porch in the floor. Porch. Porch. Yeah, that's correct. And what about you, Lauren? Do you have another superstition? I, I don't I don't like that either because I I, I feel my porch is dirty. Yes. No. <laughs> <laughs> of course. What about you, uh, Miguel? Are you superstitious? Fabi, is good luck or bad luck? I go to lot, Miguel. Of course. Good luck. Oh, Miguel. Oh. <laughs> Miguel. Miguel, Miguel, Miguel. Ay, Miguel. Okay. Well, let's take a look at this lady. What about she? Do you think she she is superstitious or he is superstitious? What do you think? She is superstitious. What about him? No. He's not? Can you please he read, Lauren? Looks, he looks mm, relaxed. Yeah. Can you read, please? Relaxed. Fabi? Yeah, Fabi. Can you read, please? Read? Yes, please. Uh, listen, listen. Is yes. Angie superstition? How about Terry? Practice the conversation. All right. Can you please write down right here. What superstitions does she have? What superstitions, superstitions does he have? Yes, guys? Yes. Yeah. All right. Page 57. 3. Building language. A. Listen. Is Angie superstitious? How about Terry? Practice the conversation. My gosh, this looks good. I'm so hungry. So am I. Could you pass the salt? Sure. Whoops. You know, it's supposed to be unlucky to spill salt. It is? I didn't know that. No, neither did I, until I read it on the internet. Actually, I don't believe in all that superstitious stuff. Oh, I do. Now I always throw a pinch of salt over my shoulder if I spill it. And I never put shoes on the table. Well, neither do I. But that's because they're dirty. And I always walk around a ladder, never under it. Oh, so do I. But that's so nothing falls on my head. Touch. One more time? Please, one more time. Yeah. <laughs> All right, one more time. Page 57. 3. Building language. A. Listen. Is Angie superstitious? How about Terry? Practice the conversation. Gosh, this looks good. I'm so hungry. So am I. Could you pass the salt? Sure. Whoops. You know, it's supposed to be unlucky to spill salt. It is? I didn't know that. No, neither did I, until I read it on the internet. Actually, I don't believe in all that superstitious stuff. Oh, I do. Now I always throw a pinch of salt over my shoulder if I spill it. And I never put shoes on the table. Well, neither do I, but that's because they're dirty. And I always walk around a ladder, never under it. Oh, so do I, but that's so nothing falls on my head. <sighs> no, nothing? 
I think uh, Angie, Angie, yes, superstition. Uh, yes, Miguel, yes, she did say shoulder. That's good. Now continue, Miguel. And you too, Fabi, continue. Uh -huh. I listen que the sponge sound in the table. It spills out, yeah. Uh, it's bad luck. Ah, it's bad luck to spill salt. Uh -huh. yeah. I like listen. Angie, Angie says it's bad luck to uh -huh. spill the salt. The salt. Don't. What else, guys? What else did you hear? Uh, uh, she read in internet. <laughs> uh, I listen push into the table, but I don't know what push. I, I, I'm not, I can't hear that clearly. What about you, Lauren? What did you hear? What about you, Miguel? What did you hear? Oh, I don't know. Do you agree with uh, with me on this one? Feel soft? Oh, yes, you did say it. Go to what? Miss Butler, listen Go to again. Restaurant. One more time. Yes, one more time. Yes. Page fifty seven. Three. Building language. A. Listen. Is Angie superstitious? How about Terry? Practice the conversation. Gosh, this looks good. I'm so hungry. So am I. Could you pass the salt? Sure. Whoops. You know, it's supposed to be unlucky to spill salt. It is? I didn't know that. No, neither did I, until I read it on the internet. Actually, I don't believe in all that superstitious stuff. Oh, I do. Now I always throw a pinch of salt over my shoulder if I spill it. And I never put yeah, shoes on my shoes. Well, neither do I, but that's because they're dirty. And I always walk around a ladder, never under it. Oh, so do I, but that's so nothing falls on my head. I don't understand the other superstition. No? What about you, Laura? Uh, Terry don't believe uh, any superstition. And well, yeah, let's do that. Is Angie superstitious? Well, Angie is yeah. very superstitious. Right? How about Terry? Terry, no. No, no. nothing. Uh, nothing, all right. Okay, Take your answers. Take your answers, please. Oh. Sorry, I forgot to click this. Listen and read. Page 57. At the same time. Three. Building language. A. Listen. Is Angie superstitious? How about Terry? Practice the conversation. The conversation. Gosh, this looks good. I'm so hungry. So am I. Could you pass the salt? Sure. <coughs> Whoops. You know, it's supposed to be unlucky to spill salt. It is? I didn't know that. No, neither did I, until I read it on the internet. Actually, I don't believe in all that superstitious stuff. Oh, I do. 
Now I always throw a pinch of salt over my shoulder if I spill it. And I never put shoes on the table. Well, neither do I. But that's because they're dirty. And I always walk around a ladder, never under it. Oh, so do I. But that's so nothing falls on my head. <laughs> so, is Angie superstitious? Oh, oh yes. 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 Hunger. Yes, Miguel. Me too. So, let's hurry up. What about Terry? Is he superstitious? No. No. Nothing. Good job. All right. Please practice the conversation. Lauren and Fabi, please. I am Angie. Gosh. This looks good. I'm so hungry. So, um, I, will you pass the salt? Sure. Oops. You know it's supposed to be unlocked to the hole. Lauren? Fabi? Oh my gosh. Fabi, are you there? Fabi. It is. Vige, <laughs> <laughs> are you here? Always. Uh -huh. uh -huh. All right, Fabi, can you practice, please? Yes, I love. Terry. And so on? It is. Uh, it is? I didn't know that. No, neither did I until I read it on the internet. Actually, I don't believe in all the superstitions stuff. Oh, I do. Now, I always threw a pinch of salt over my shoulder if I spill it. And I never put shoes on the table. Well, neither do I put that because they're there. And I always walk around the ladder, never under it. Oh, so do, so do I, but that's a uh, nothing falls on my head. Perfect. Now, who agrees with Angie? Who? Yeah, who do, who agrees with Angie? You, Fabi, or you, Lauren, or you, Miguel? I agree with Angie. Yeah, and what about you, Lauren? Oh, I don't agree with Angie. No, oh, and you, Miguel? Hey, Jack, what? A breakfast. Yeah, we all need to do breakfast, don't we? What about Terry? Who agrees with Terry? I agree with Terry. And you, Fabi? I disagree. Yeah? With yeah well, well, so so. Terry, do you agree with Terry? Good job, sir. Thank you very much. Next. Underline two expressions above that mean me neither or me too. Can you find them in the conversation, guys? Okay. Me neither or only neither? Me neither or me too. Two expressions that mean and two expressions that mean Nanji, no, neither did I. Yes, neither did I. That's a good one. And 
Terry, neither do I. Neither did I. And which one? The other one, Terry. Yeah. So do I. So do I. No. And that's me neither or me too? Me too. So do I. And so do too. I. And where is it? I don't see it. Can you connect it, please, honey? The last part. For you, Miguel, can you please connect it? Fabi, can you connect it, please? Yes, that's a good one. So two more. Uh, maybe here. I do. No, that's not me too. In the second line, so am I. Me too, no? Yes. What second? Second line, Terry. So am I. Uh, so and I with me too. And one more for neither. Terry, well, neither do I. Me neither. Hi. I'm afraid. <laughs> All right. Yeah, there you go. Good job, ladies. Now, the last part. Responses with so and neither. Can you read this, Lauren? Grammar. Uh, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. And then Okay. Fabi. So and I. Yes. Next one, Fabi. I always walk around the either. Ladders. A ladder. Ladders. Ladder. Lauren? So do I. Yes. Lauren? I'm not very superstitious. Fabi? Neither and I. Yes. Lauren? I didn't know it was unlucky to feel so. Fabi? Neither did I. Okay. And the last example. I always put on weight at Christmas. Me too. I do too. So do I. Okay. So notice these are the same answers. Me too. I do too. So do I. Yes, they are the same answer. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yes, Lauren? Yes. Is that difficult? Um, a little so so. No, no, it's not difficult. I teach. Let me see. I need you one. need breakfast. I need only. Remember, I make study. Yeah, study. There you go. Okay, guys. So, you want? Let's see. Can you please read the samples? I like playing computer games. So, so here we have a, a verb. I like. And the uh, and the response is I do. So do I. Ah. Yes. Next, next example. I want some coffee. And the answer is So do I. So do I. Next one. Mm, I love chocolate ice cream. Yeah, me too. And so do I. 
So do I. And the negative. I know how to speak Japanese. And the negative neither. response? Ah, no, me neither. And neither do I. Yes, neither do I. Continue. Now in past. I went to, I went to the movies yesterday. So did I. This is in past. Now, uh, another with model verb. I can fly. So can I. So can I. So can I. Now with the verb be. I'm tired. So am I. Yes, so am I'm I. Happy. And next Bobby. one, Neg negative. I'm not happy. Neither am I. I'm not. What? Oh. Schizophrenic. 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 Oh. And neither am I. Neither am I, yes. So here we have this little thing. Would you like to take a picture so you can study later? Yes. Hold on a second. I'm not hungry. Just take a picture because we have to continue. Yes, what me? Yes, I. It's confused. I mean, yeah. it is another one. Take a picture. Yeah, I take. Which one? This is different. Ah, it's different. Lauren, did you take a picture? <laughs> did you, did you yeah, take a yeah, picture? Yeah. It's finished? finished? All right. Yeah. Take another picture. Finished? Finished. Yes. All right. Now let's let's do this exercise. Jane likes swimming. So do I. So. Sue doesn't like chocolate. Uh, so don't like. Read instructions, Fabi. Uh, Ah, uh, neither do I. Number three. Uh, John doesn't eat frogs. Neither do I. Continue. Yes, Lauren, two please, one and one. I don't like watching movies. So do I. And um, Maria doesn't have a car. Neither do I. They don't have a dog. Neither do I. She likes cats. So do I. She doesn't like snakes. Neither do I. She plays football. So do I. I, um, I can... Pretend? I can see the last one. No, it's okay. Let's go for the next one. Now look, now we're gonna play this exercise. Jenny watches TV to relax. Okay. Bob is not the same. So the answer is but Bob. Awesome. Oh. It's different. You see? Lauren? Yes. Okay. And the next one, number two. Amy never eats beans, and Susan is the same. So do I? No. He is the same. So Jimmy never. Ah, uh, never. Never eats his beans. Then neither and, is. And Susan and so does Susan. No. Neither, no? And neither, yes. 
and neither does the sun. What about number three? A bill of ten goes swimming when it's cold. Yeah. But Anna doesn't. Dawson? Perfect. Anna doesn't. Yes. What about number four? Mike doesn't like pizza. Mm -hmm. And neither does Anna. No. Does Carol? Uh, but. 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 Uh, she does. But Carol does. But okay, it's a little difficult here. I'm not talking. Number five. I can go running. I can go running every morning. So does he? And Harry, or does Henry, or oh, Henry? Okay. We never go to the movie, but 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 they do do. Perfect. Good job. But they do. They do. Next, number Congratulations. seven. Congratulations. <laughs> I, I, I often eat you, uh, but she doesn't. She doesn't. Good. Okay, hey, Carolyn looks beautiful. Look beautiful. And 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 so those yours perfect oh. <laughs> yes, but we don't go out for dinner very often and they Oh, no, and so do they? We don't. Ah, we disagree. Yes, uh, and neither. neither. Neither do they. John eats his lunch in the park. But uh, you don't? Yes. <laughs> okay, let's see. Lauren? Yes. Is it I'm difficult? Thinking. Is it very difficult? Yes. A little difficult. Why? A little. Why? Um, Look. Remember. So, and neither, what are they for? To agree or to disagree? So, is to agree. And neither? Is uh, an agree. No. Both agree. Is agree too. Yes, uh, they both agree. That's what you get confused, Lauren, because they both I agree. agree. So, is positive. And neither negative. is negative. Yes, yes. But they both agree. Yes. Both so agree. when they both agree, we use and. And when they agree, is and. You see? Yes. yes. Okay. Look. When they agree, it's and. 
But when we disagree, what do you say? But. But when you disagree, you say, but. Yes, Lauren? Yes. But. And so forth, okay? And all you have to do is use so or neither. But when you disagree, you say, but Bob doesn't, or Anna doesn't, or, but, here. Why is this positive? Because the sentence is negative. Because it's different. Uh, yes. And this one is negative. And different of negative? What is different of negative, Lauren? Never. What is different? What is different of never? Yeah, always. Always. Right? Yes. Lauren. Yes. Are you there? Yes, yes, I am. What is different of what is different of negative? What is different? I don't know. You don't know what's different of negative? Positive, no? Positive. No, Lauren? Yes, I think, yes. You think? <laughs> I'm not sure. You're, why? We never go. It's negative. Yes. We never go. And what's different of never go? I go. Yes, positive. I Correct? Yes. 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 All right. And let's see what's next. Respond. Mm, we're going to do this tomorrow, okay? Okay. Yes, okay. And we'll be finished for today, guys. Go ahead and do the homework in your workbook. Okay. I will. I will. Lesson B? Yes, the homework in the workbook, and we'll continue tomorrow. Okay. All right. Okay. Miguel, any questions? Lauren, any questions? No, teacher. Not Thank you. Yes, Miguel. What's your question? Wait a minute. Because, because, because you don't study, you don't do your homework, and you can't find a cell phone so you can speak with us. That's why. Yes. <laughs> A study and do your homework, Miguel. Yes? Yes, you are. But hey. I'm Miga. Hi, Miguel. <laughs> All right. Thank you, ladies. Uh, how was the class? Was it very difficult? No, only a little bit. A little confusing at the moment? But check, check the uh, check the video. Yes. Okay. Repeat the video. I study a little bit, and then we'll practice tomorrow. Okay. Yes. Okay. Teacher. All right. Thank you, Miguel. Thank you. Have a nice day. Have a nice day, guys. Yes. Bye. 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 Bye, Miguel. See you.